Anak to those of you watching on over in Fiji. How's it to those of you dialing in throughout South Africa? We have Carl Tanana up in the commentary box sideline. Is Rob Vickham and Vix. You send these guys up close all weekend long. Who's the energy with ahead of this cup final? Well, you saw the pictures there, Shorty. This crowd is absolutely buoyant for some Fiji entertainment. We've been promised a bit of Fijian flair from Gareth Baber pre and during that anthem. And it's going to be one special moment, absolutely personified by these scenes right now. Well, the ball, girls and boys, were the good luck charm for Fiji last year for large parts in the cup finals. They found themselves in six gold medal games. They won five. This is their first this season. Will that ring true again in 2020? Time to find out. James Dolman has the privilege of guiding these 26 men around the park for the next little bit. Batitsu with a start in this one. Gareth Faber has been mixing up. He's starting side all weekend long, keeping them fresh. And the rain starts to come down once more. It has been a wild weekend in terms of the conditions. So too has been the Sevens rugby. And this is the last game. And the perfect way to round it out. Fiji v South Africa. Down towards Heddle. Over the top of Heddle. And sitting here for Buckley and Billy. Over the top to Darren Alungi. Getting close. Darren Alungi. Held up. Wow. What a start. Well, South Africa. Held up. Get Five the minutes, lift sir. wrong. And it was nearly a perfect start for Fiji. Bakuru Nabili just pounces straight on it. Dead in the lung. He's been a monster all weekend. Look at that. JC Pretorius, desperation along with David. Stop that one. Two white coming in Five. to feed the scrum. Six. That is Mbluffa in behind. That wide Stop. left is Chui Mumba. For Q2, center field here for Fiji. No, he's holding back. Okay. One time, one warning. Crouch. James Solomon gives the forwards their instructions. Five. Set. Two up. Pulls it back, foot and bluffer. Puts here too. Has to wait for that pass and now looks to get to the outside. Great tackle it was from the Springboks. Captain Hans still with Fiji though. We need sign off. Bluffer thinks he's got it done. What does our assistant ref and ref say? Which is Kelly weighs in. Try Fiji. Well, it's been a real secret for Fiji this weekend, the hot start. And they get another one in the final. Bortito goes out wide. Hahn with the nice tackle but it just comes out the side and this guy well everything he touches is turning to gold he has been an absolute magnet for the ball all weekend long has napoleoni mblatha right in front of his flags as well the conversion good too it's been a good hunting ground, Australia, Sydney, not so much. They've never got the big prize here in Sydney. Well, they are up by seven here against the Blitz box. Butitu, more ball for Fiji. Bluffa, buying time out, finding Darren Alung. He has to go up for it. And Heddle manages to knock it out. Good work in defence from Justin Heddle. Great Both rush from the experience of playmaker Justin Heddle. Sized up the situation. They've been in three out of the four cup finals. South Africa, one in Dubai. We're runners up, silver medalists in their home patch. Missed out last weekend, but they've come this weekend to Australia Five. with a bit of determination. Six. It starts to hammer down here at Parramatta Stadium. The rain tumbles. Davids takes it away. Head up. A good tackle there from Balatha. A bunch there though, Fiji, and that's going to provide Angelo Davids an opportunity to carry it away Tackle! up and over halfway. Hans, Heddle, look at the rush from Mother Nathangi. 
Shuts down Davids. In turn, gets it away though. And here comes Zane Davids. Zane Davids. Getting through the line and out crunched by Batutu. BG scramble. They've got them cooked out wide here. The blitz box, it goes through the hands. And it is 7-5, kick to come. Time's off. Time's off. Bakuruna. Too white. Yeah, Bakuruna, Billy, I think it is. Put a Too late white. shot on Chris Dry, and he might be sitting down for a couple of minutes here, I think. Shoulder charge. Yellow card. Oh, so a double blast there for Fiji. They leak the try plus. Bakuru Nabili sits down. But what a break. Here it is here. No arms in the tackle. Bakuru Nabili. This is a nice run from Zane Davids. And this is what sets up front football. JC Pretorius as part of the new crop that has really graduated this weekend from the blitz pocket. JC Pretorius with his side's first try. Conversion, no good. 7-5, it stays. So that first incursion into the Fijian 22 brings a result for the blitz box. And now that won't go the 10. Not 10. Back to halfway we come. And Jerry Tua will be happy just to slow it down here. Wipe some seconds off the clock. Down a man. He gets his runners set. Two eye towards the line. Over foot and Balapa. More than a thangy. More than a thangy. Bumps his way into a couple. Got his knees to the ground there. But now James Dolman says it's a maul and will give the feed to South Africa. There's no need to ground. Yeah, well, I think Jerry Two Eyes come and connect it. As wide, soon as he does, it becomes a maul. I actually thought more than a thangy got his knee down before that. That's what I thought. Turnover. Green ball. In any case, it is going to be a blitz box scrum no, feed. No, and it's still Five. seven on six for the next 30 seconds. Set. Pedal looking for the clean feed. Getting it now. Spits out the back. And he takes it on himself. Gets through the line. But James Solman has pinged South Africa. For obstruction at the scrum, Carlton. Yeah, I think he's isolated Chris Troy holding in the Fijian forward plate. Not allowing him to get out of that scrum. It's a good knock to touch as well, and that'll enable Vakrun and Billy to come back onto the field as well. Here it is here. Oh, there it is, there, just on the left of the screen. They actually did that a couple times last week, went oh, yeah. undetected and got points on the other yeah. side. So, James Solomon, wise to it. 7v7, Darren Alungi brings it down for Tuai. Tuai, the up, the opening try scorer. Gets through the line initially, gets through the other side, and away he goes for another! He is having some kind of weekend in Sydney. Napoleone, Malapa. Oh, shot the front door. Look at him go to work. Had no right to score this. Goes through two of the Blitzbox's best defenders. Hits the angle. Another one, he brushes us off. Oh, man, oh, man. This kid is good. Weiss and Athungi not available for this one. Out injured, and that's enabled Balapa to... Start for Fiji. Seven points the difference. And there is your signet pressure play from the first half. Time for a little more action here at Parramatta Stadium. Touch deeper with this restart down towards dry. He wants to go again right on half time and create some room for Pretorius who angles back towards the sideline. Can't beat Vakrun and Billy. He gets dropped and then they strong over the ball. It was two eye. Jerry two eye. Blatter wants his third and he's off the mark. He'll have to come back. But Jerry two eye. They just couldn't shift him. He's the best in the world at doing this. Look at it coming in from sweeper, locking over the ball. He's so strong. He takes his medicine from Justin Hadul, but he stays strong, Jerry. What's your question? 
The teacher will plug the line here. Oh, he's getting greedy with a kick towards the line, and it's going to run dead in goal. And James Simon says, guys, that'll do us. It's gone by in a blink, and at the break, it is Fiji up over South Africa, 12 points to five in our gold medal game. Watch the stars of figure skating compete at the Four Continents Figure Skating Championships on NBCSN and NBC. Each year, Americans waste $21 billion by overpaying on car insurance. That's why I went to thezebra.com. Because while every company claims to save you money on car insurance, the Zebra shows you who actually can. Compare car insurance for free at thezebra.com today. Introducing the Hometown Collection by Fanatics. Wrap your team in city with this collection of locally inspired graphics designed for the fan. Available at fanatics.com. Shop now and get today's special offer. Fanatics.com. Officially licensed everything. Now starting to pull away. Simone. Welcome to Wednesday Night Hockey. The main event. Center stage. Where the best teams. Fired up. What action. Brightest stars. It means world-class talent. On the biggest stage. Play each week. Oh Wednesday Night Hockey on NBCSN. We have just seven minutes to play at the HSBC Sydney Sevens at Parramatta Stadium. There are our World Rugby Sevens social channels, Facebook, Insta and Twitter all covered. Make sure you hit those up post-tournament too. Get a feel for some of the highlights across the weekend. The golden boots of Justin Heddled and Chris Dry on display here. That, an acknowledgement for those playing in their 50th tournament, all bet up. And that's the milestone Justin Heddled has hit this weekend in Sydney. South Africa with it all to do. Down by seven. The ball in the hands here of Davids. Goes down towards Tuai, and he grabs it beautifully up top. Now it spits out the back, it's loose. Tuai picks it up. Vakarun and Billy towards Dry. Tuai. Down a Lungi, looking for the reload ball there from Balafa. Won't get it, more than a Thungi. Accelerates into contact. Pretorius over the ball, they need to get a shot on here, Fiji. Can't do so. Holding. Turnover. South Africa, they come quick through Hans. Zane Davids. Help set up his try sides first and only try. Heddle, there are the golden boots of Justin Heddle. Six out now. Zane Davids is there. It's loose again on the four out the side. It comes. And it's there for Fiji who've got to scramble for it here. They lose it. As Hans gets his hands all over. Now Fiji get a muscle on. And after all that, James Dolman says. Blitz box scrum feed. Oh, it's just such a war at the breakdown. We always knew it was going to be. Both teams are so strong. JC Pretorius from the restart got a nice turnover for his country. It's been a masterclass by the young man in that department. He's been an outstanding pilferer for his side. Well, this won't trouble the Blitz box, this scoreline. In their last cup final meeting, it was Singapore. At halftime, Fiji led by 19 and got run down. So, the Blitz box won't worry a bit about being down by just the converted try. They're in the right part of the field here now to potentially level things up. Center field scrum. Eight from home. Heddle. It's a good clean strike for Justin Heddle, and they go short side, Hans. Sitting over to Davids who can't hang on. PG will be happy just to slow it up there and pack the scrum. Well, he knows that was a key moment for Salvin Davids to try to create the one on one with Bolatha. Very, very treacherous conditions. The rain just started. 
before the end of the first half. So those balls are very tough to take. Okay, time still up, guys. We've got green six. Substitution here with Werner Koch coming onto the field. What a great replacement. The coach Neil Powell to call on. And as you'd expect, with our two Premier sides going at it in the gold medal game, we've got two Premier players make it three atop the tournament point scoring Five. list. Haven't seen a whole lot of Angelo Davids in this match just yet. He's been starved of possession. Two up. Dangerous across their own try line. Look at the hard carry there from Ratu Voka. Ratu Voka looking for people to run into and over. Darren Alangi, gee, they were loose around the breakdown there, South Africa. Lucky not to be penalised. Fiji play on and hack it up the park. Davids is back to Imamba. Picks him up and dubs him. Let him get to his feet. He must but get gets penalised for doing so. You haven't ground. seen any of those two, have we? Really, to Imamba or Angelo Davids really hasn't gone their way. It hasn't been that type of game. It's been tough. It's been uncompromising. The lift there from Tui Mamba. Let him get to his feet. Just a casual 80 kilo deadlift up on halfway after charging Time's 50. Off, no problems for Tui Mamba. Shoelace. This is where Justin Hadul is just so good. He's going to have Selvin Davis to his left hand side. He's got his captain, Stephen Hans to his right with Werner Koch. They love going the blind two here, South Africa. They put players in motion. Kettle looking to create here. Koch lets it go across his face. And there it is an Angelo David bouncing in field and now losing it backwards for Hans. It's play on. That's created some room for Kettle to line up. David to David. Zane David. Wow. 12 plays 10, and we've got the conversion to come. Just so inventive, first to try and get Angelo David into the game. It draws over defenders and it opens up the left-hand side of the field where this guy has been a physical presence for the blitz pocket this weekend. Fijian fans hoping this one misses the mark. David sends it on its way. It hangs out to the left. And Fiji hang on to that two-point lead. Oh, it is a bit like that, isn't it? Punch and counter-punch. Fiji still with a slender lead. Restarts have been so dominant. Jerry Tiroi got the last one. Do they go there again? It's the cup final. We wanted and we're getting. High quality from both sides in tricky conditions. Oh man, it's his own man. How about that, Thakal Balavu up and over his own man, and now it's loose Bunners from Fiji. Home. Lost, and with South Africa, the restart going awry for Fiji, and now South Africa lose it. Under pressure there. Lost forward. Quite often that would be called advantage play from a knock on. Is another Lost look forward. at Thakal and Balavu, and you're not supposed to be there, fella. Yeah, well, that's the man Always coming there, guys. Lost towards the ball. Big thing. Oh, this, this is just the conditions. It's very humid. The ball slippery. It's the rain as well. Thumbs up. Kanakonda. Set for some game time here as well as Alessio Nanduva for Fiji. He goes far side, replaces to Imamba. We're good. South Africa looking for their second title this year and to stay in the race with New Zealand for the overall series title as well. Fiji looking for their first ever gold medal in Sydney. Mines! They're the most successful side ever in Australia, but Sydney has not been a happy place for a collect. Back it comes for the blitz box. David, that was Selvin David, throwing it out in front. The Duplessis. Hans. The pick up from Koch. Koch. Showcasing his pace, but he just made Ratu Voka aggrieved, and he goes across and gets him. Hans. 
It's a big defence from both sides here, just tossing bodies around, and now Fiji win the penalty. They look to go quick, and James Solomon says they're in front of the mark, come back a foot, do it again. Oh, Bakuru Nabili. What a time for a steal, the big number two. He's such an active player and so tough to shift from the ruck. That is brilliant. Are they clock managing here, Carl Tanana, or are they just looking for the knockout shot? Oh, no doubt the clock management. They know there's less than a minute to go. They know if they win this line out. They know if they keep possession, oh. those balloons be going even Same higher. Line, yeah. OK, Lighton. It's 2 high with the line-out throw. Time's on. And it's a great take up top as well. Down for 2 high. They've got 30 seconds to try and hang on here against the blitz box. Penalty, Fiji. Jerry 2 high. No, 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 no. He knows the situation, the experience of the World Sevens Player of the Year. Kick this out. They look to go quick initially, Ikanaconda. And there will be one final line-out for Fiji to try and bring down and close it out. And look at the part of the field, they're going to have to do it in front of as well. Stacked with Fiji and fans. Fakal Balavu goes up, it goes over the top, it's with the blitz box, Dupria. He comes away with it. Great tackle and cover from Ukanaconda. That was Africa going back to where it began dry. Chris Troy holds his feet nicely. Party mails all around Parramatta Stadium for a second. And now the error. Fiji hang on. Fiji win it. For the first time ever. Fiji are number one in Sydney. Well, Carl Tanana, what an absorbing, enthralling, thrilling game it was. And Fiji doing...